we could bottle up and keep it, I could retire early because I think that yeah. we'd be able to sell that for some pretty good money. Uh, that will not be the case. We have sunshine today. Beautiful green uh, grounds, trees, everything because of the rains that we've had recently. We've got more rain coming. 68 out there out of our Sherman Chevrolet Cadillac Tower came our next storm system currently out over the West Coast. We're going to see that moving inland later on this week and we're going to have several days of active weather starting overnight Tuesday, but it's mainly going to be Thursday through Sunday for us here now east of I-35. Your Tuesday forecast 51 early south winds increasing by the afternoon a little choppy if you are headed out to the lake partly cloudy upper 70s for those high temperatures rain chances going up and down a bit. We'll see some storms Wednesday afternoon. We'll see storms again by Friday and Saturday and then possibly even into Sunday morning and Sunday afternoon before that exits off to the east, but it's just going to be several waves of thunderstorms arriving over a multiple day period. We're going to jump right in Tuesday. Currently, this does not include our I-35 corridor counties, but just one county over, so we will be watching for that to be expanded, possibly farther east. Not out of the question, but a low risk for that for tomorrow. Then we move into Wednesday, part of Garvin County included in that severe weather risk. This also could potentially be expanded as we head closer towards midweek, so we'll be watching that. And then by Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, here's our severe weather risk. It's right over Texoma, damaging winds, large hail, and a tornado threat. Red. They're both days towards the end of the week, including your Saturday. Uh, that doesn't want to load either, but Saturday is also under that risk. We're going to be seeing storms arriving generally Thursday onwards, but we'll have rain in and out Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. And then again by Wednesday afternoon, there's some of that severe threat on the way by one to three o'clock in the afternoon. Here's Thursday night or next chance for thunderstorms and that'll last overnight through Friday morning and Friday afternoon. We'll recharge again. Saturday, another chance for storms on the way for the afternoon and evening before that exits off to the east. And we're also going to have some chances for storms there by Sunday. Rainfall totals one to three inches. Some could see locally higher amounts. That'll be over a multiple day period. Your seven day forecast sponsored by Get Roofed. 80s back by the weekend with south winds and those lows in the upper 60s. Guys.